Viserion and his brothers fly ahead to investigate Dragonstone while their mother proceeds there by boat. Upon Jon Snow's arrival at Dragonstone, Viserion and his brothers fly overhead and visibly scare both him and Davos Seaworth. Tyrion then comments that he has not yet gotten used to them either. Later, Daenerys tells Jon that both Viserion and Rhaegal were named for her deceased brothers, Viserys and Rhaegar, respectively. Viserion accompanies Daenerys, Rhaegal, and Drogon as they attempt to rescue Jon Snow and his expedition force from the White Walkers and the Army of the Dead at the White Hunt beyond the Wall. Viserion and his brothers burn and destroy many of the Whites while Jon and his party mount Drogon with Daenerys and the captured White. Not long after they arrive, however, the Night King is given an ice spear by another White Walker, and then hurls it at Viserion. The spear pierces the dragon's neck, causing blood and fire to erupt from the fatal wound. With a screech of agony that mingles with his brother's cries, the helpless dragon crashes into the frozen lake and sinks into the water. Later, Viserion's corpse is hauled up from the lake by the Whites, and is resurrected by the Night King, becoming an ice dragon, his eyes glowing with the same blue tint as the White Walkers and Whites. With Viserion as his mount, the Night King leads his army to Eastwatch by the sea. There Viserion blasts the wall with blue fire, eventually destroying the castle and the easternmost portion of the wall, allowing the army of the dead to pass into the Seven Kingdoms.